You don't fly, you can't fly, neither can you, oh my god. What up, David here with some more Pokemon Shining Pearl. We're going into, I think, Uxie's Cave? Valor. Valor Cavern. I think that's Azelf. The mission is proceeding without a hitch. The boss should be pleased. Everything is for everyone and the good of Team Galactic. Or everything for everyone is for the good of Team Galactic. You know what I mean. I recognize your face. You're the child who raided the Team Galactic building in Eterna City. <laughs> Jupiter should be ashamed of herself being beaten like a child. But being beaten by a child like that. But anyone and anyone that opposes Team Galactic must be crushed. Even the very thought of opposition will not be tolerated. We're fighting Saturn! What a wonderful way to kick this off. Hello, Mr. Catman. I met your ancestor recently. Coin, I believe her name is. Got a Kadabra. Uh. This should be fairly straightforward. You can't bend this giant metal spoon of a penguin. Brrr, uh, I honestly think pluck. I think this thing needs to get plucked. Because his defense sucks. Rain Dancer, are we trying to use Thunder right now? You know what? Tis a gift. Kadabra, you have given me a gift, and so I will use it. Brine. That's gonna make that stronger. <laughs> you did it to yourself. All right, so now it's raining. Do you have some dick that's gonna use thunder now? Toxicroak. All right, I think while it's raining, Brian is probably still the better option, even though... <gasps> oh, okay. You got dry skin. Well, Vaseline is your friend. But for now, you're gonna get plucked. Now I know. Yeah, I figured it would do half. All good. Now that revenge is gonna hurt. Oh, dish served cold. All right. And now that's gonna heal you up. Ugh, that healed a lot more than I wanted it to. I know you don't have a citrus berry. That would have been real nice. Oh, it was still enough. Okay, I'll take that. I feel like that should have let him live, but. I will happily take that. I think Toxicroak is Saturn's ace though, so what's the next one? Bronzor. Yeah, let's swap out. I think you you did a you did a great job, Herringway. This rain should wear off. I'm not too worried about it dampening my fire type moves. Oh no, it's still raining. Okay, fine. Well, you know what? It's flamethrower time. This should still destroy you, even in the rain. Okay, okay. Made it a little bit weak. Confuse Ray. Why would you do this to me? You're just drawing out the inevitable. Mr. Saturn, your planet isn't even in the backdrop. Or maybe it is, and it's just not visible right now. Uh, chop it. Oh my god, are you serious? I should've just used Flamethrower again. I just thought I'd be c cool and clever. The rain is still happening? Now you're gonna hit yourself. Mm. You know, it's okay for me to be wrong from time to time. Yeah, well, there's nothing to pay back. I slapped myself. Now the rain stopped. I can see clearly now, the rain is gone. Set the little coin on fire. All right. <laughs> ah, melted bronze. You don't even look like you're made of bronze. So, we've beaten Saturn. You, my friend, are tough. I can see why you defy us so. That's actually, that sentence says a lot about his character. It's like, clearly, if you have the power to defy, then you shall. You have the right. That's interesting. Gah, even I, a commander, only managed to buy us time. Well, that's fine. A child like you will never be able to stem the flow of time. Team Galactic will get the three legendary Pokemon of the lakes. Within their power, with their power, we'll create an entirely new universe. 
By now, Mars should have captured the Pokemon of Lake Verity. You just teleport? Bro, you know he's using escape rope for all that. Okay. Oh, it's so weird seeing these caves after, like, I just did these caves in Legends Arceus. They look so fleshed out. Alright, they're, they're just saying the same nonsense. Uh, can I get by the carp lady? Nope, she's gone, but she left all the carps. It's terrible. I believe when Azelf or Uxie returns to this place, they r refill the lake. I don't think it's gonna look decimated forever. Anywho, it's time to go to Verity, and I forget exactly where Verity is, so... Oh, I think Valor is actually Azelf. Verity should be... Oh. Wait, this is Verity? I thought that was Acuity. Okay, whatever. Anywho. Okay, I'm not gonna make the same mistake I did before. Now, if I'm correct... Yeah. This generation let you go straight to boxes, eh? Okay. So let's just pull out my... Do I not have a flying type? I never caught a flying type. Oh? Please evolve into something that can fly. That would be really freaking funny. Bum the hatching eggs on I was gonna fry it. You can't fly! YOLU. Outta here. Alright. Its body is lithe yet powerful. It can crest the mountains, three mountains, and cross two canyons in one night. Damn, son! All right, we have no use for that. So, I need a little fly thing. I need a flying thing. So here's the deal. I can do several things. I think what I want to do, I'm basically gonna start walking back. However, I'm gonna keep an eye out for something that can fly. Hmm. Oh wait, actually, I can- I never surfed to this, did I? Which means, I think... I don't know if this- I don't know if surfing this lets me go around the world, but it very well might. And then the other element is that I might run into just a wild pelipper or something, so... Fingers crossed. Or it's a dead end and my life sucks. Oi. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go with plan A. We can explore that later. I'm sure there's stuff to do there. Flying type! Show me something with wings! You don't fly. You can't fly. Neither can you. Oh my god. Oh hey, there's an item. Oh my god. I was never here when it was surfing time. Also, this thing cannot fly. Poison jab. Okay, that's possibly useful. No wings here. Bidoof doesn't fly. I know what you're gonna say, that was B barrel. Maybe this patch or not. Wow. Oh, hey, there's an item here I never got. Oh, well, because I didn't have surf at the time, I think. Well, let's grab you, shall we? Rose incense. I am incensed. Made it to hard home without catching a single wild flying thing. Chopman does not fly! I could go surfing down there, there's probably an item, but no time! Definitely nothing in here can fly. Although Chingling's cool. Made it to Jubilife without finding anything that flies. I swear to god, if I find a Starly right in front of the- oh my god. You know what, we're getting it. I'm not even gonna use a quick ball, just a Pokeball. I'm not weakening you. Haha! -ha! Well, here I am in Sam Jim Town. Does that mean I'm gonna teach Starly to fly? Hell no! I've done it this much. Oh my god. I don't care what kind of wild goose chase they send me on after this now, because now I have the power to fly. Verity Lakefront. Yay, Veritily. <laughs> Verily. 
<laughs> now, give me this thing. Let's do this before I goddamn forget. I think it was 95. Oh, it was 94. Cool. Break it on Jet Boy's face. And now, we can fly. But it doesn't matter because we're here by Verity. So that just set me back a good 12 minutes. Aw, oh, Dave, what timing. Those Team Galactic Scoundrels are after the legendary Pokemon. You've got to help Dawn. Alright. Ow, ouch, what's with this old timer? How dare you, you misguided thugs. Dawn needs your help. Oh, yeah. I like to imagine Rowan's just, like, grabbing this guy in a chokehold. It is our mission to stall you. Sorry, but we gotta do our job. In order for us to bring peace to the world, we must control it. Well... How do you expect to control the world when you can't control me? Oh, these two grunts, they got six. Alright. Glameow and Silcoon. Did I catch Jetboy at level two? He, it's at, he's at level 11 already. God. Stunky! Glameow! Golbat and Glameow. That damn bird is level 18 now. <laughs> After one battle, losing was part of my job, too. I feel bitter, better saying that. You're too young to understand. You're too old to be doing this. You weirdo. You're both weird. Oh, jeez, big surprise. Good god, this, this damn bird. Cannot wait to ride this Staravia. And it's gonna turn into a Staraptor. I'm probably... But before I even leave Verity, Jet Boy, you're you're getting a lot of credit for battles. You're you're you, you just joined the team, man. You really want to learn Endeavor a second time? Fine. You know what? On the off chance I can do the bullshit, I will give you Endeavor because you have a quick attack. That's basically it right there. <laughs> now all I need is like Endure or a Focus Sash. Won't allow anyone to stop us from gathering the three Pokemon from the three lakes. Our boss always had a plans for the three lakes. While you're blissfully ignorant, our work went ahead. Alright, these two. Oh, it's Mars! I'll knock your Pokemon into orbit. If this mission is successful, we'll get a nice bonus. Oh, well. I'm gonna get a nice bonus from this amulet coin. Two grunts. Well, at least they only have four. Stunky and Beautifly, or vice versa, followed by Glammeow, followed by Glammeow. All these people have are Krogunks and Glammeows, man. My mind is going orbital. I'm heartbroken. Well, well, thanks for the bonus. Ha, gotcha bonus, gotcha bonus. This Pokemon here, the Pokemon here has already been taken to our HQ and Veilstone. It's far too late for a child like you to make any difference. I want Team Galactic to be powerful. That's all I want. Okay, well, that's great. Don! Dave, it's to Team Galactic! Oh no, the Pokemon of the Lake! Alright. Don't you be messing with my Mesprit! That phase, it brings, it brings back bad memories. I'm talking about the Valley Windworks. I caught a whole lot of trouble for that little incident. Why is it acting like I don't know your name? I fought you! What's with the look on your face? You do remember me, don't you? Fine, whatever, I'll tell you who I am again. I'm Mars, one of Team Galactic's commanders. It's really funny that I think they made the main character forget about her name at all. <laughs> How cute, you think you can save the day in your little game of hero? Not a chance, not even a teeny one. You're, go you're all going down. Mars, you got nothing on Arizu. Just saying. Challenged by Command Mars. Right, what do we got here? Golbat! Oh, it's not even a double. Don, what are you doing? Just watching? Alright, so we got a boss. I'm gonna just set this thing on ice. I can't wait to take your money. Oh my god, that Golbat literally ate an ice beam. Okay, bye, sir. Have a great life. Oh, this goddamn bird. It's gained like 18 levels, 19 levels, and counting. All right, all right, kill this coin, flip it with a brine. I wonder if this is enough to Oko you. You got big defense. 
Oh, that's a critical? Yeah, you got big defense. Confused, Ray, why? Couldn't you just gyro ball me or something? Well, you wouldn't do that. I'm a steel type. Or extra sensory. That's a fun one. Okay. Don't hit yourself. That is... Disobedience. Not a fan. Pay back. Oh, well. Nothing to pay back once again. Brine it. Brine it and do not hit yourself. There we go. Winning, winning. Oh my god, another critical? What, what are you on right now? Okay, we got one more. I'm pretty sure it's Perugly. Right? Yeah. This thing. Eliminate you. I forget, what does Jupiter have? Because Saturn's got Toxicroak. Mars has Perugly. And Jupiter, I could have sworn she also had Perugly. I'm, I, I'm definitely wrong. She's got something else. Hmm. Yeah, and Ice Beam did not do anything, so let's brine it. Oh my god, that does a lot more. You got a berry, I should have plucked your ass. Okay, well, it won't make a difference. Eliminate. Brine it to death. Oh, after getting slashed a little. Somehow, not a single slash is getting critical, unless the first one did and I just didn't notice. Okay, and that's how you get a bird to gain 20 levels in one screen of trainers. Ugh, oh, again and again. Yeah, thanks for the cash! That's the, the, the other grunt's bonus right there. I lost again. So first it was Valley Windworks, now it's like Verity that I owe you for. This shouldn't be happening to a Team Galactic Commander. Calm down, Mars. I've done my part in all of this. My mission was to transport the Lake's Pokémon to our HQ. That's right, I accomplished my mission without a problem. Team, we're pulling out. The boss is waiting at the HQ. Pokémon of the other three lakes, or the three lakes are connected somehow. Thanks to Saturn's grandstanding at Lake Valor, a cavern appeared here. It was the cavern where the Pokémon Mesprit slept. Mesprit appeared too, probably gonna help its friends. That worked out well for us, it was super easy to catch. So now we've got them all. Mesprit, the being of emotion. Azelf, the being of willpower. Uxie, the being of intelligence. Now that we have all three, you can look forward to what Team Galactic has in store for them. And yet none of them tried a Pokéball. Trainer ID still up for grabs, just saw all I'm saying. I see. This also occurred at Lake Valor. Another legendary Pokemon was taken away by Team Galactic. Both of you went up against full-fledged criminals. The fact that you are unharmed is reason enough to celebrate. But what about Lake Acuity? Is Barry safe? I believe this is the point where Barry gets wrecked by Jupiter. Alright, let's find out. Oh, no, no not you again. Alright, worried about Barry. Okay, here we go. This time, we got a Jet Boy who gained literally 20... Uh, why can I not use your... Why can't you fly? Can I... Bruh. Oh. Did I not need to catch a damn thing? Fly. Wait, have I not been up there? Oh, I haven't been up there. I haven't been to Lake Cutie. Well, how about that? Okay, I guess it's time to go to Celestic Town. Damn. Oh, yeah, I probably need to use Surf or something. That thing's a Storap. Oh my god, I just got a Wild Storaptor. Freaking Jet Boy, why do I even own you? Oh my god, I am such an idiot. But also, this is not how Pokemon's supposed to go. It's not supposed to be this easy. But, I know my complaints will fall on deaf ears. Will you go away? There we go. Ugh, I cannot believe all that for a bird that isn't gonna take me anywhere. Sigh, Mount Cornet. You know what I'm gonna do before I do anything else? 
will not be bothered. Okay, so yeah, I remember it was a dead end when I couldn't use strength. And I'm probably gonna run into a place where I need to use surf too. So I guess we don't need to worry about anything. I, I just gotta fly around. Yeah, we I, we haven't been to snow point yet. I'm actually shocked. Oh my god, I got to use the defog man. All right, well I might as well use it like this. All right, a wild staraptor. How the frick were you even in the cave? All right, I'm taking this. It's mine. Do not come and fight me. Do not fight me, whatever's inside that. Okay, good. <sighs> Lovely. Yes, I'm a little salty right now. <laughs> okay, oh, there are items up there, I bet. Anything invisible? Anything invisible? Oh no. Right. The power of the woodland creatures. We got a Bidoof smashing rocks, a bee barrel moving rocks around. We got Staraptor defogging the place. Soft sand. This is great. I'm like a Disney princess. All the woodland creatures are helping me. Alright, yes, another. I would activate my bike, but I like the music here. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Five, just lying there? Okay, I'll take it. Mmm. So many items. There's a little treasure trove. I like how it's just a fist. The animation of a fist. Ooh! What are you? Oh, a lot of good items around here. Okay, I'm already bored of this. <laughs> so now, we got you. And we got an elixir, but I barely know her. So I think this should go upstairs. I, I get we might as well take a look around. Be barrel. Okay. And yep, there is one item. And only that one, eh? Alright. Light clay. Probably will never use that. Probably a total waste of time, but I gotta collect. If it's there, I gotta collect it. It's playing the game. Hmm. So now. Mount Coronet's a pretty cool area. I like how it just cuts right through the middle of the region. Hmm. My treasure senses went off. But I guess not. So now, I'm sure there's other parts of that I can explore, but hey, now we're here. Now we're on our way to Snowhead. We're gonna see my girl Candace soon. Oh. And yeah, we're like traveling again, so. Yeah, so much for the Verity shenanigans. Nope. I'm an ace. I can see that you're an ace too. Oh, thank you, sir. Wait, are you an ace trainer though? You're not, you're a... Oh no, you are an ace trainer! Oh, that's so cool! They have like, weather-specific clothing, that's dope. Got an ambipom! We've never seen an ambipom before, I'm pretty sure. And again, it's so cool to kind of be up in this area where it's all snowy after playing Legends. Because... You know, you just like... You just... It's so much more fleshed out and you can kind of see like this compared to that, and it's just, it's really interesting. Baton Pass, wow! For Kadabra, eh? Well, just gonna wait, waste time while I get buffeted. You're also getting buffeted. Alright, let's pluck this thing. I think we can kill it. Yeah, look at that. I'm pretty sure Fuego's the one to give to the... To the, to the snow point gym. Jet boy, I don't even know why you're here. I never needed to catch you. Catch you. Alright. Alright, I guess we got buffeted. 
Just gonna keep getting buffeted by everything. Ambipum! What do we got? The uh, Metal Claw. We, I never use Metal Claw, really. I should start using that more. It gives you stat buffs, if I'm correct. Alright. Blake! Just as I thought. What? What did you thought? What did you think? You can pretend to be ordinary, but your eyes tell me another story. Yeah, that's right. I'm a boss. No, no. Aha! I got past ya, and I'm gonna get past ya! And so I see two chainers, snowbound lodge. Okay. Okay, and there's a lot to explore in this area, because it looks like I can go further up there. No, no, I did not mean to do that. Let's... Yeah, so I'm going north. So I should probably explore this, I guess? Yeah, yeah, let's, let's fight this guy. Or gal. Are you a novice or are you capable? Are you a skier? Skier Edward! You got a sneasel! All right. Uh, have we seen Sneasel? We're seeing a lot of Pokemon that I've never seen before. And I guess... I think it's time to retire Herringway. He's done a great job, but... It's definitely time to let Fuego get some spotlight. Because she'll just decimate everything in this area. Do not freeze me. I'll be mad. Oh no, it's just speed, right? Yeah. I don't think this has a chance of freezing. Uh, but Herringway keeps getting buffeted. It's a buffet of buffet. Wow, that was enough to get you the other attack. Wow. Alright. Okay. Well, who needs speed? When you get plucked. I think it's such an attitude. <laughs> well, it's dead. Oh my god, this damn bird. Alright, what do you gotta say? I never expected you to be an expert. That's right. I am very expert. You know how to play your Pokemon with an edge. That's right. I'm an edgy... Bastard. All right, let's switch this item with Fuego. Lego, my Fuego. Oh wait, no, switch him. Gotta switch. And now we're going to destroy everything in these mountains. You are the first to be ready to answer any call, to be ready to accept any challenge. That is the way of a trainer. All right, we got a nice trainer in. In, in, in a snowsuit. Ace Trainer Maria! Not gonna lie, she cute. But, it's a duck! Wow, okay. So, you thought you could fool me! Well, guess what? You did. Well, I'm not, I'm not afraid of your little Kanto duck. Kantonian duck. I got psychic. Is Golduck part psychic or pure water? Okay, it's pure water. And you didn't even use a water move. Well, that's just the way that cookie crumbled. I'm not complaining though. Let's psychic. Yeah, I should expect the ace trainers not to follow suit with the theme. Okay, no. Oh wow, everyone's getting close to 50. Yeah. Alright. Oh, Buffett. Warren Buffett. Oh, it's Sudowoodo. Yeah, another thing that I'm pretty sure we could just Psychic. In fact, we might even be able to destroy this. Or you can try to use Shucker Sucker Punch and miss because Fuego loves me. Oh, that's right. Okay, what else you got? I think you're finished, right? Oh, Thunder Wave. That's a pretty good move, but let's... We, we won't bother. Okay. What's next? What do you got? Actually, I probably should have kept Thunder Wave. Because of Mesprit. Bonita. Well, 
You know what? I feel like chopping you. Cross it! Chop it! Oh, you dead. Okay. That's a good battle. That's a good team to be fighting at this stage. If only I weren't overleveled, but how oh, disappointing. You know, life's filled with disappointments. You can make all the preparation in the world, but it does, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Ain't that the truth? I can do nothing here. Any item? No. Oh, I love the touch that the snow's a little bit more rough up here. I'm fully kitted up and equipped. Any time will be fine. Any time. There's no time like the present. Laura. She's got one mon, and it's a Lapani. Again, a, a lot of cool Pokemon to be fighting right now. I think I'm going to show these battles because... Although, I feel like I may have seen Lopany before, but it's just uh, a nice melange of creatures we're seeing. I could chop it, but I'm pretty sure this will kill. Oh no, you're tough. It is fully evolved. I should have expected that. Come on, I think Psychic will do the trick. What you got? Nothing. Okay, I think we fought enough trainers in this area. There's a lot to be explored in snow, 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 whatever. Huh? Perhaps I should change into a more comfy outfit. Uh, you basically said perhaps I should slip into something more comfortable. Don't think that went... What the frick is going on with you? All right. Ice heal. Yeah, he might need more than an ice heal. He's just twirling away. Oh, and that was all that was, which means it's time to end this episode off. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like this video if you like this video. Subscribe if you haven't. Smack the bell so you never miss a thing. Consider supporting me on Patreon. Thank you, Bladed Cross and Fill in the Blanks, for supporting me on Patreon. In the next episode, we'll continue through the snowy tundra after resting up at the lodge. For now, this is Dave out. Peace out. Later.